Hello folks, you're very welcome to number 55 Belfry Avenue here in Dundalk. I have a great house to show you. This is a detached four bedroomed house and when I say four bedrooms I mean four double bedrooms, one of them en suite. It measures about 140 square meters so it's a big amount of house which is fantastic. So if an upgrade or an upsizing is what you're looking for then the chances are number 55 may very well suit your needs because it has all that you need it has utility downstairs toilet and really good condition nice sized enclosed back garden and it's not it's very private at the front because it's over a green area and it's private at the back because of the layout of the development now belfry is also within walking distance of the town center so this is a property which you could dramatically cut your car usage if, for example, you're finding that you're spending a lot of time in the car. But in any case, it means that the entire uh, spectrum of amenities and services is on your doorstep because you're just off St. Alphonsus Road. Several uh, national and secondary schools are nearby. And of course, DKIT is a short drive or bus journey away. So an awful lot going for this property in this really nicely maintained development. Uh, we're on the market now. And if you would like to take a closer look, then I encourage you to do so. So please let us know of your questions and let us know if you want to make an appointment to come and visit number 55. In the meantime, let's have a look inside and you'll get an idea of what's involved, okay? So we're heading in through the front door into the entrance hallway, lovely solid wood, oak floor here. And you also see important features like here, lovely radiator, cabinet cover, these little extra layers that really add important um, important features in a property and really make a big difference. Now, one of the things that I've always really liked about Belfry is the fact that it's flanked with two reception rooms. So I'm here now looking into the first reception. It's the smaller of the two. It's a perfect size for many things. For, so, for example, for a playroom for the children, for an office, for work from home, remembering that that's always important. Here in this instance, you see very cleverly serving the use as a little home gym. So whatever the purpose, there's always great benefit and opportunity to be had from having that second reception room. It also has the potential to provide a bit of downstairs accommodation and um, if that's important because it is big enough to be a double bedroom. So that's the first bedroom. These, sorry, that's the first reception room. And these spaces, of course, looking out onto the front of the house. Now I'm into the living room. It's a lovely space. It's really nicely proportioned. That wooden floor continues on through here. Um, it's got double doors through to the kitchen diner. So when they're open, you have this lovely jewel aspect. And then of course, when you don't want the, the, the noise or the trouble of the kitchen, close the doors and it's a lovely living room space. But as you can see there, plenty capacity there in terms of taking your furniture. That's a big chunky suite of furniture and there's no problem with it. Another thing that I always like to point out when I see it is when there's a fireplace that's never been used as a fire, which always indicates to me that it's a nice, warm, cozy house. Anyway, I don't know if you can see that There's a little plant in the way. Anyway, lovely cast iron uh, inset around a sort of contemporary solid wood and um, looks like oak fireplace. So that's this space uh, looking forward out the front door. And then, of course, don't forget, because we are in front of a green area, there's nothing in front. It's fantastic. Look. Nobody looking in there at all, which is absolutely brilliant. So now I'm going to go down through here, through these lovely double doors, down to the kitchen diner. This room runs the full width of the house. So it's a great space and it's a nice bright space as well. Um, first, the dining area. Obviously, it's all got a, a tiled floor. It's very practical. Um, it's a really good amount of space here because you can see there, that's a big, big uh, dining table and chairs and absolutely no problem accommodating it. Sorry, I'll just zone out there. So you can see there, even in this instance, there's space for a sofa as well, for a lounging area. And then around to the kitchen, a lovely pippy oak solid kitchen. Um, really nice, because here's the thing, when the kitchen is good quality like this at the beginning, simply if you wanted to, to refresh it in the future, all, all it requires is painting. Uh, it doesn't need to be replaced. I mean, that's a great looking kitchen. Uh, and I really like the three panel layout of the, of the doors as well. I think that's very smart. So, uh, as I say, going from left to right, you have a dishwasher. They're all freestanding appliances. 
In fact, here, all of the appliances are freestanding. Space here behind me, and I often find that in Belfry, the um, fridge freezer is freestanding in that space and there's plenty of room for it. But you can see here from standing here, it's a lovely layout because you're here, you might be in the kitchen working away, easy to the dining room, but then also easy to know what's going on around there in the kitchen diner. Now this is the utility, again, high marks for a good uh, big utility, like there's plenty space here. As I always say, a, a utility room needs to be able to accommodate you if you have to fire your, <laughs> your laundry in here or your, your drying um, your clothes horse or whatever it is, and that one does very well. It's, um, it's also got your gas boiler in there. Okay. And that gas boiler um, is fairly recent, actually, as I understand it, and very good service history on it. So that is the downstairs. Let's have a little look outside in the back garden. Now, another great factor to point out to you with this property is that again in the back garden there's absolutely zero overlook because you're looking onto the gable end of the house in, in behind which is which is just the best case scenario um, it's it makes for a tremendous position and there you see it's a lovely sized back garden there's a lovely little patio area there outside the French doors uh, for coming outside and using the space well little garden shed over here low maintenance garden, side access, it's, it's got a gate on it. But it really is just absolutely uh, what, what so many people are looking for, just low maintenance with either potential to do something or opportunity to do nothing in the garden in terms of gardening. That's, the, that's a lovely little sunspot there. Isn't that nice? Now, we're going to go back in through and we're going to then have a look. Oh, I should also tell you, there is a guest toilet downstairs. Before I forget, there we have it. And it's a very nice guest toilet too. Right, let's have a look upstairs. So now we're upstairs in the first floor landing and we're into the first bedroom. Now the thing about Belfry is that all of the bedrooms are double. It's a big bonus in that sense. It's always been a really big uh, bonus factor for me for these houses. You can see here in this property, what they've done is they've put in slide robes at one end. So two things there. One, you're getting lots of storage space without losing out on floor space, but also a lovely bounce of light across the room. Like that's a double bed and there's plenty of space around the bed. It's a great, a great proportion. Then over to the next room. So this room is actually being used a little bit more so as an office or TV room, you know, and but I mean, it is a double room. You can see there, you could equally fit some storage in there if you wanted to, but very another very capable space. Then into the main bathroom in here, lovely bathroom, fully tiled, separate shower. You can see that. Really nice condition all the way along. Third bedroom, again, a lovely big double. You can see there, you see in this instance, it's actually been adapted for the work from home whilst also being, you know what I mean, having a workstation as well as the bed and everything. And that's what these big rooms have the potential to do that really you can, you can, you can use your house very wisely according to your needs. Um, space there for your wardrobe. And that room again, we're in the back of the house, so looking out. Looking out, you can see there, down where we were at the back garden. Okay. And then um, also another thing to point out um, is in Belfry, you have this lovely, very big uh, double door hot press. And into the final, the main bedroom. Again, a super sized room, super size. And more storage here with these slide robes, which again has light uh, benefit, but also, you know, gets all the storage taken care of. This room, of course, en suite. Again, like the other, the main bedroom, main bathroom, it's fully tiled, you know, it's got an electrical appliance in the shower. And it's really a space that, you know, it's, it's a very um, easy to live with, color scheme and layout and so on. So that is the fourth of the bedrooms. 
And then looking out, of course, you're in a lovely quiet setting here, which is a real bonus as well. So folks, thank you for coming along to see the property. Uh, if you have any questions, please do let us know. And if you would like to make an appointment to view this property, give us a call and we'll be more than happy to accommodate you. In the meantime, be well and uh, keep in touch. Bye bye.